just so you can see, I am driving a 2000 Chevy Silverado. It has four wheel drive, an extended cab, has a, I'd have to measure the bed, but it's a 1500 and it's a 4.8 liter engine. Hello people at Extra Lights, I'm making this video to show you the functionality of the products I ordered from you. So first I will show you the caution flashers, the brake lights, and the turn signals, and the reverse lights. As you can see, when I take you up closer, the little side lights are working just fine. The grids are just fine. None of the LEDs are burnt out. And also note that my license plate lights are working just fine. While the truck is off, I have an interesting thing that comes up. The, which this isn't really that bad, but if I try to use the turn signals, while the truck is off, they hyper blink. So we see here on the dash, and if we go to the front, this light hyper blinks, and if we go to the back, we'll see that it hyper blinks there as well. And I'm never going to be using my turn signals while the truck isn't moving, but I would like to know. Uh, what causes this hyper blinking and what may be done to stop it. I have two issues I want to ask you about so I'll start with the LED uh, license plate lights. Here they are my LED license plate lights and I'm going to take one of them and show you what issue I have been having underneath the truck here. The light, the LED, or the lights you saw from my license plate previously, were halogens, and they were the original stock ones that came with this vehicle. And grab a light so we can see what's going on. And this way. So, it's uh, right in here, this is where the license plate light is. So, let me find a place to hang this up, where I can get it to sit, just a minute. Okay, so I'm going to remove this assembly, and turns. Here's my original bulb, which we know for a fact is working, and I'm going to replace it and put in the LED bulb. So, the old bulb is out. Let me put in the new LED bulb. The new LED bulb is in, and now we will test it to see if it works. Just turned the truck, I just turned the truck on. So if we come under here and take a look, this LED light is not on. Let me get this light away from it, see if that changes anything. It's here in the dark. Nope, that light is still not on. And if we take a look over here, 
this one is on. So, to me that indicates that the LED light is not compatible. And just to verify, I'll install it, like I'll turn it the other way, I'll turn it around here to see what happens. Ah, there we go. So see, so the light works as it should. But the issue at this point is that it doesn't fit inside. So it works. I'm going to turn the truck off because I don't want these fumes getting in the house. So the LED is compatible for my license plate, which is nice. But the problem is, is when I go to fit in this housing, that can't go in all the way. This to where that where this part right here needs to be flush with this other part that's on the frame that bulb is too long and because that bulb is too long what happens is it ends up hitting this plastic piece that is let me get the light on it so you can see it ends up hitting the plastic piece right here that little cover so the bulb is compatible with my plug-in but it doesn't fit the next complaint that I have is that this is the LED uh, backing up light and while it fits inside the housing it does not work with the plug-in so I'm going to demonstrate this issue now here I have the light taken off of my truck. This is supposed to be my backing light, which is uh, currently the original halogen bulb. And as you saw before, it was functioning fine. So I'm going to take that out now. And it has a, a rather snug fit to it. It fits in there just fine. But when I go to put in uh, the LED, it doesn't fit very snug at all. That's about as good as it goes in there, and it doesn't have the same clicking sound that my original bulb did. Uh, it's very easy to pull out, just a very slight tug, and it comes out. So I'll try turning it around the other way just to be sure that I'm not putting it in wrong. No, doesn't appear to be any different. So now, for the real test, I'll see if it will work this way. And if that bulb doesn't come on this way, I'll pull it out again, flip it around, and test it once more. As you can see, I currently have the truck in reverse with the e-brake set on, and that light is functional. This light is not. Let me flip it around. Uh-oh. And nothing. Nothing happens at all. I'll try the other bulb now. Nothing happens this way. And nothing happens the other way. So this verifies that my that the LED backing lights that you sent me um, were either faulty, not compatible. I, they don't really fit as well as the original one does, so I suspect that they're not compatible. And it's not that they don't work. So, yeah, just please get back with me as soon as you can about these issues. Thank you very much.